Yo, what's up, guys? My name is Native, or you can call me Young Bear, Bear, whatever fuck you want to call me, basically. And uh, I'm joined by the Architect, also known as Nick. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's get into it. We're playing zombies today, Cold War. And uh, you've never played Cold War Zombies, and you know nothing about it, yeah? N nothing, nothing. All right, it's loading up. I literally have not played anything. Dude, I've literally been waiting, like, waiting to play this game with you for so long. I've not watched any gameplay. I've not like look at any maps previews or anything. Not even the loading screen. Not even on Twitter. But I've been off Twitter this last week. I've just been playing like multiplayer or Modern Warfare. Yeah, and so I set you up with that. You have the knife setup, right? The knife and the Aether Shroud setup. Yep. I'm waiting for the game to load. Yep, it's still loading. Uh, okay. Are you in loading screen? Mm -hmm. Not even, not yet. I'm how up oh, there we go. All right. Ah, machine. So, do you want to explain a little bit? Sure. Oh. Do you do you recognize that building in front of you? Kino. That's from uh, Black Ops One, right? It's also yeah. It's from Black Ops One. It's also from World of War. World of War. Yeah. There we go. That that building. I saw. Yeah, that building. The yeah. one before that, I guess. I think I got the right spot. So, Casey, what happens at the end of all Ready Zombies games? What is your we fate? Yeah, that's no longer the case. So, at round 10, um, and, and, and every five rounds after round 10, uh, you can opt to exfil, to exfiltrate. And if you can complete the exfiltration, I won't tell you how, like what goes on, but um, basically there's like a little trial, and if you complete the exfiltration, you'll escape the map with your life, and you'll be rewarded with like bonus experience and bonus uh, upgrade crystals. They're called Ethereum crystals. We believe this location is the cause of the dimensional breaches we've encountered. Strike team, mm -hmm. get down there. Why didn't put me full screen? What? You're still here. Hello. Hello. Am I game in the? Am I, am you're I in. Game? The, you're in the game. You're just kind of like chilling there, though. I'm protecting you. Oh, now you're running. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Help. Oh, you're stuttering a little bit. All right. You good? I'm still lagging. Hello. What's your PSF? Forty sixty. You're lagging at forty. Yeah, sixty. It's going right. between 40 to 60. Should I just cap it at 40? Yeah, or, or, yeah, you should cap it at 40. I run at 40, and um, it's fine. I, I, I mean, I know it probably runs. It can run more than that, but um, it caps at 40 because my computer's weird and dumb. One well, okay. Uh, where is the cap again? It should be in graphics, I think. Can you protect me? Yeah. Okay, there you go. It's capping at 40. Alright, so, you notice when you kill zombies sometimes, they'll drop like a green little package thing. I'll let you get the rest of the kills by the way so you get some points because I've been killing all of them. Maybe save one though, if, if there's more. Okay. Um, so you notice, have you seen the green little like piles that they drop? I need to turn them down. Yeah. Yeah, so those are salvage. So come over here. This is a, ta this is a crack table. There's like a. Oh, what are you doing? Uh, I was fixing something. Oh, what's right. it? Come this way. So the green piles that the zombies drop, and there are also blue ones. Uh, those are salvage. This is a crafting table. You can craft stems, grenades, monkey bombs, and score streaks using salvage. And how, wait, yeah, and how do you get salvage again? One more time. Uh, they're random drops from zombies. So there's two kinds. There's basic salvage, and there's high grade salvage. They also drop equipment, as you can see. A box. Yeah. If you're lucky, they can drop things like score streaks and self revives too. Really? Yep. Um, oh. so, yeah, so yeah, so you can use you can also use salvage to get armor. So you remember armor from World War Two? Yeah. That's made its return, but it's a lot better. Zombies can drop armor plates to repair it. You can repair it using salvage, which is a lot cheaper than paying with points. And also, uh, a carpenter power up will now completely repair your armor. Got the points. Nice. So there's there's also three. Uh, three levels to armor you can you can level up your armor to, to tier three 
as well as your guns have rarity, like in Warzone. Oh, uh, that's annoying. What's annoying? I just look away at my screen and my gameplay is all fucked up. Rip. It's not zoomed in, it's zoomed outwards. <laughs> Why do you have so many issues? Alright, should we like go to a different area? Wait a second. It's not, let me go to my other screen. Hopefully it doesn't lag my fucking game. Am I in the game still? You're in the game. Craft at the crafting station and your score streaks, but your armor you need to go to a different station for. Um, so in this game, a couple things you should know. There's, uh, it's like Black Ops 4. There's no, um, there's no, uh, where you shoot them in the leg eight times to get more points. You only get points mm -hmm. when you get the kill. Really? Yeah. So it doesn't matter if you shoot them in the leg. It also doesn't matter if you reload. All right, and also, uh, how much does this cost? So we could we can go through. Yeah, so the max the max the max uh, ammo will automatically refill your clip. Oh. And uh, we could, so there's two doors. You go through that one or that one. Oh, okay, we're on this one. Hello. All right. Oh, automatic flashlight. Yep. So, um, from here we need to go upstairs. I think I might have enough. Yep. And then we'll have like a um, one more door two for twelve fifty. What? Is it a four hit or two hit? The knife? No, for me. What are you on about? A four hit or a two hit? For my health, retard. Oh, okay. I uh, you're at one fifty health, right? So that's uh, three. Hit. Yeah. That's like three. It changes. It's weird. So zombies don't do as much damage. Shit. Um, you want to go by the next door? It's right here. It doesn't do any damage. You don't worry about taking damage. So here's the box. Um. Uh. So yeah. So it's it's like a so on higher rounds you're gonna be a three hit and Jug will make you a four hit. Um. Oh, there's also a new thing called decoys. They're like weaker version of monkey bombs. They don't explode, for example. Um, and they only work for like a split second. But if you need to like get away, it's easy. To, it, it's like an easy save. All right, I'm going to buy the next door. You want to come here? Oh. Okay. Oh, are you getting a box open? Oh, okay, yeah, so here's how the box works. So you see how you have like a weapon rarity? A rarity? It's yeah. probably like green right now. Yeah. Um, so there's like there's like weapon rarities just like in, in in Warzone. The best one is legendary. Uh, and weapon rarities are act, uh, will actually do like a lot more damage. Okay. All right, come come this way. You can upgrade your weapon rarity. Oh, it's fifteen hundred. Rip. Hold on, I need a few more points. Uh, I can't even drop uh shit down for you. Yeah, it's fine. I need like one zombie kill. Um, but yeah, so you can upgrade your weapons rarity at any time. It's just really expensive. Um. You also can pack punch up to three times, and you also can buy your pack punch like ammo modifiers separately. So you can choose what ammo modifier you want. All right, let's go. Is there soul boxes in this or no? There's one soul box. So you probably should get to that first, right? Um, let me think. Which one is it? It's the. Uh... Oh yeah, we can't do it yet. We need to we need to wait for the boss zombie to spawn in. Uh, wait, what? We need to wait for the boss zombie to spawn. Not oh, the actual wait, boss boss, but like you know how like in Mob of the Dead you have like the warden for example. Alright. Yeah, uh yes yeah, 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 sort of. Um alright, so this is a uh trials, like in uh like when you have to complete trials. We can do those if you like, but um they're not that important, so it's up to you. Uh let's see what's important. All right, so let's go to a, a door. Yeah, so first step is restoring power, I guess. Ooh. Oh shit, I should have waited actually. All right, so do you wanna go this way or this way? So this way is Speed Cola, this way is Deadshot Daiquiri. Deadshot Daiquiri got to actually upgrade too, in this game. Speed Cola. All right, 
So here's your speed cola. Um, so this um, right here is like an Easter egg thing. This thing up here. Yeah. Oh. Uh, okay, I think I can buy next door. Oh, nope. Need a little bit more. Alright, I'm buying next door. Alright, this is the this is the main underground laboratory area. This is where this is the machine. Power's over here though, so and you need uh I think seventeen fifty to open next door. No, two thousand. You need two thousand to open next door. Points are higher on solo. So I'll, I'll let you get some kills so that because um, you're closer. By the way, if you get headshots, you do get a little bit more points than if you use body shots. Okay. So he body shots will give you 90 points and headshots will give you 115 points. Oh, Jesus. Okay, oh. come by this door. Oh, you'll notice... You know the stupid. Okay, real quick, I'll explain in a minute. Go ahead and come get this door. And then this is the power switch. Wait, is that a sniper on the wall? Yeah. I'm getting. Oh, that. You, you can all see the, the rarity on there. It's purple, which is like epic, I think. So this is power. Yeah. Go ahead and turn power on. Wait, where'd you go? Alright, so you'll see the, like, this, like, ring in the middle is, like, lighting up. Yeah. Uh, we need to turn on the terminals, so. One terminal over here. You want to get the other terminal? Where? It's it's highlighted on your screen as terminal. There's a marker. Oh. Yep. And let's try and get the zombies down to one as well. Yeah. Make sure you save like five bolts in your gun as well. All right, you see the the thing in the middle? What's going on? I did not yeah. believe it true. So that's an anomaly. That's the portal that goes to the dark aether. We'll go through that in a second. Let's just get done the one zombie really quick. Is that, I killed mine. All right, I got. Oh. Just shoot over here. Go and kill him. Got him. So I think you should actually build a knife too while you have your guns out. Um, as long as you have your knife as your secondary. But yeah. Anyway, so let's go. Let's go over to the uh, to the anomaly. Wait, what'd you say? Uh, you should be able to knife too. Um, with your knife, as long as you have your knife as your secondary. Yeah. Yeah. So, oh wait, really quick. You'll notice you're literally able to walk everywhere. Like you see where I am right now. Like you can hop over railings, jump over railings. There's no like invisible walls that like keep you from going wherever. Rip. Oh. Jump it! Jump it! Jump! 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 Yo. All right. Uh, let's go this way. Come this way. What's happening? We're going to the Dark Aether. Oh shit, we have dogs. Okay, let's go this way. Go, 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 They should be one knifed as well. But they, they're, they're, uh, explode and they're like poison gas. Okay, let's go this way. I don't like those. Take this tunnel for 500 points. Go. All right, you're gonna. There's gonna be like a, a little part on the ground next to you. Uh, it's gonna be like all glowy and like weird. Yeah. Pick yeah. it up. Run over to the where the anomaly was that we just entered. And there should be like a highlighted area. Ask you to craft it. The machine. Craft. Yep. Craft it. Uh, I don't know how to get over there. This uh, way. here, I'm coming over to you. Where are you at? Oh, uh, I know where you are. Just go through the door. You don't, you should have to buy any doors. Oh, right here, right here. Yep. All right, so come over here. I found out. This way? I just didn't know how to get out of that room. Help me. You're Help. good. You're, you, you run faster. You run faster than the dogs. Really? Yep. So go ahead and craft the machine. Look familiar? Are we getting raped by the... Mildly. Wait, so... My... By the gas? Yeah, so the gas does do a little bit of damage. 
Alright, so the machine is pack a punch. Okay. Alright, we're gonna have a boss zombie spawn. We need to get up out of out of this room. How do we pack a punch all the way? You need five thousand points for the first time, fifteen hundred points for the second time, and thirty thousand points for the third time. We just built pack a punch right then. We just built pack a punch. We need to get we need to get the fuck out. We need to get the fuck out. Come this way. We're gonna get our ass kicked. We need we need to get the fuck out. Why don't you just train him? Um, this tight room is like really dangerous for that for your first time at least. I don't know like how difficult this is gonna be for you. Oh, I heard that. Yeah, let's get the fuck out. Let's get the fuck out. I don't like that. Um, let's go this way. All right, so this is one of the really good training areas as well. I'm gonna buy a shotgun so I have something to fight him with. Where is he? Your tomahawk's also one shot too. If you pick up a tomahawk, I believe. Wait, did he not spawn yet? He usually always spawns right after the after the dog round. I don't think he spawned yet. I think he's gonna spawn next round. All right, you know. So get down to one zombie. Do not get that. It's not worth it. Yeah. Oh, another thing. Insta kills don't give you any less points. Wait, really? Yep. The more you, the time, more more times I use my uh, special, it works better, right? Or the more no, it no, that's a Black Ops Four thing. Um, I'll upgrade it. You can only upgrade it uh, outside of the game with like the upgrade crystals. All right, so let's go through the portal again, and we're gonna go collect some parts. I mean. Wait, wait, don't end the round. Don't end the round. Careful. Oh, I wanted to buy. A, should I buy? Wait, should I buy a jug or no? Um, no. No. Why? Yeah. I'll tell you later. It's a surprise. Actually, let's go do that really quick. Let's go do the surprise. I want to show you something cool. This is a, a hidden Easter egg that's really easy to do. It's one. It's a one-step process. It's it's uh people refer to it as the coffin Easter egg, but I won't say anymore. This will end the round though, but that's fine. All right, so there's gonna be five. There's five glowing orbs. I'll show you where they are. One is right here. Shoot it. Okay. Two is over here. Three. Is you see it's up there in the corner? Where? Up there. I can't. Um. Oh. Kill that zombie with you. You already have one. Yep. All right. So it's up here in the corner. You see up. Look up. Nice. Four uh, is over here. Right here. Where? Right there. Oh. Okay, and the last one is this way. It's like it's it's this is kinda of hard to find. It's like inside the barrier in the top left corner. Okay. Did I get it? Yep. Yep. You ready? Mm-hmm. For what? Oh yep. <laughs> <laughs> you can't kill any of these guys, don't try, but <laughs> They're just jamming. Oh, what the? <laughs> They're doing the coffin dance. He's cheering. They're cheering. <laughs> you see this box they're holding? Yeah. That has some good things inside. You're just bad. I don't think I can get up there with you on. Oh, I can. Don't call me fat. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> Wait, is there a unicollision? I guess so. Weird. All right, they're almost done. Oh no, they're moving it. All right, so now go down there. Oh shit. Quickly open that. Okay, pick up that purple thing. A knife. Yeah. Rip. That was Jug. Get the fuck out. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, that's that the boss. Happened? We're getting the fuck out. We need to get out. Where? Just leave. Just I don't care which way you go. Just get the fuck out. Where is that he? guy. He's the guy shooting the giant green things. Why? Why is he that? <laughs> All right. So yeah, so that that's that's how you get one free juggernog. Every time, it's jug. Oh, you also get, You also get a free weapon, but we got a knife, so that was kind of useless. All right, so we're gonna need to deal with this guy. Free weapon. Uh, it was a knife, so we didn't really didn't get anything. But it usually gives you a free weapon as well. Oh, she gave me the op. Wait, I might go buy that sniper in there. Right, we got a boss to deal with. Cool. So. so, he's kind of a pain in the ass. You want to help me? He's a fucking bullet sponge. I'm good. <laughs> oh, we, actually, we need to stand right here and let him shoot us. Stand over here, stand over here, stand over here. Hi. Shit, all the zombies are in the way. Fuck. Watch behind you, watch behind you, watch behind you. Alright. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Man, you bitch slapped me. <laughs> yeah, he, he does a lot of damage. He's just a fucking bullet sponge. Really quick though, before we before we kill him, I want him to shoot this thing really quick. Why? It's like a, a one weapons upgrade step. There we go. Alright, now we can kill him. Actually, I have a, I have a blue, I have a, I have a blue rated gun, so my gun actually does a lot of damage. But oh fuck! Get him! Give me! All right, now we have two of them to kill. Shit, I'm so low. All right, let's kill these guys. <laughs> we literally have people to kill and you're hitting a box. <laughs> oh, uh, by the way, as the what I was what my point was about the mystery box was as the rounds go up, you have better chance of getting oh shit. You have better chance of getting good shit. Don't die. Okay, we have zombies spawning on us now. Alright, I did a lot of free damage on him. Just whatever you do, don't die. You don't have to get me, just don't die. Why are you proning? Oh. He <laughs> jinxed it, man. Anyways, that's gonna be it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to check out um, my friend Native in the description. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you liked it, tell me what you liked about it. If you didn't like it, tell me what you didn't like about it. And subscribe for more content. Thanks again for watching. Bye.